you know, I I looked up the definition of milk on Google and um the definition I got was an opaque white fluid rich in fat and protein. That was the definition I got. But you know, I think milk has another definition. And that is the Dragon Ball series. A series that should have ended after Z but has continued to continue to continue to continue to visit the same cow demanding more and more milk. The cow being blind in one eye, having a limp, the, the udders being all shriveled up and broken. And still that very same cow is expected to perform, to keep performing, keep producing more and more milk when it should have been put out of its misery years ago. You know, you can tell Toriyama doesn't give a damn about Dragon Ball anymore, but they're going to keep paying him, so he's like, oh, hey, I'll pull something out of my ass. Okay, here you go, Dragon Ball Daima. And it's crazy. I, I can't even really blame him because I'm like, hey, if they're going to keep paying you for producing garbage, then why not? I mean, they're paying this man to keep coming up with garbage. Like, he knows how moronic the Dragon Ball fans of today are. And they will literally watch anything. I mean, they watch Dragon Ball Super, for fuck's sakes. And they, they read the manga for that terrible, terrible Dragon Ball Super. They watched those terrible movies, didn't they? This man has been eating off of Dragon Ball most of his life. And it's honestly downright impressive. But Toriyama, what is this? I mean, even for your standards, even for the money stand, what the hell is this, Toriyama? Kid Goku again? Like we didn't already have GT and, and then these losers will say, Oh, but come on, young, come on, young. I mean, like, come on. Dragon Ball GT wasn't even canon, man. And so, so this is basically like it's canon. So this is, you can't count GT. I don't care. Listen, this has already been done, Kid Goku. It's nostalgia bait. And it's like Toriyama. This man must be getting up in age because how do you not realize that this was already done before? Do you have early symptoms of Alzheimer's? What is going on? He had to have known that this has been done before, Kid Goku and all this type of stuff. But like I said, he probably just doesn't even care. He's like, I'll put anything out and these losers will watch. It's true. People will be feeding to watch this new installment of garbage, this new installment of Dragon Ball garbage. Come on, what a joke. Let's turn everyone into babies and call it a day? Who asked for this? Who asked for Dragon Ball Nursery, Dragon Ball Infants, Dragon Ball Kids Next Door? No one. This is trash. I'm embarrassed. As a longtime Dragon Ball fan, I am simply embarrassed. I am single-handedly responsible for getting Dragon Ball its popularity. I was rushing home from school every day. It used to come on Cartoon network at 3 o'clock p.m. I still remember I was younger watching the latest episodes of Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Z. I was putting my friends onto Dragon Ball. They would be like, hey man, let's go outside and play, ride some bikes or something. I say, hey, listen here, you shut the hell up and you watch Dragon Ball. This is Dragon Ball's time. Sit there, shut up, and consume. Eyes glued to the screen as soon as I would say that. They knew I was not the one to play with when it came to Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Z. I had a Dragon Ball themed room, posters everywhere, bed sheets, figurines, DVDs, manga. To this day, I still religiously, religiously collect SH figure arts Dragon Ball figures. I, my collection is godlike. I have so many figures. See, I'm not like the rest of you losers that discovered Dragon Ball recently, started watching Super, and thought they were doing something. No, I've been doing this for years. I've been around for years. Toriyama owes all of his success to me, and that is a fact, not an opinion. But with all that being said, I can't blindly support garbage. As much as I respect Toriyama, as much as I love the Dragon Ball series, I cannot... I can't respect this. I can't get jiggy with this. I can't get down with this. It just can't happen. I didn't support Dragon Ball Super. Hell, I didn't even support Dragon Ball GT. Did Dragon Ball GT have a couple of cool designs and stuff like that? Yeah, I'll give it that. But story-wise, character-wise, it was terrible. Same thing with Dragon Ball Super. I boycotted those series. The movies, I, I watched the movies, but the movies were terrible. You know, 
I will not be supporting this. Like I said, this is just this is abomination. This is an abomination. It, it's a blatant cash grab for lower level thinkers. Now, is it better than One Piece? Yes. No matter how bad Dragon Ball gets, it will always be better than One Piece. That's a fact. But this is still absolute garbage. Toriyama, you should be ashamed of yourself. But it just goes to show anything for the money. Certain creators will give up any integrity, any dignity that they once had for their series as long as that paycheck is right. And it's just so sad to see. You know, and of course we'll have damage control from losers maybe coming to this video or uh, striking down any criticism talking about this saying, well, it's just a teaser trailer. You haven't, it's not even going to premiere until fall 2024. So how can you sit here and really say that it's going to be twat? You have to wait till it come out to take twat. If you don't take twat, you wait until it come out to take twat. You don't take twelve before it come out because did you take twelve before it come out before you even watch it? Did, did, did you go, like shut up? See, you are not listening to the ramblings to the um, to the language of someone that doesn't know what he's talking about. Now, to the uninitiated, to the lower level specimens of this world. <laughs> You might sit here and think what you're listening to is some rando on the internet rambling. But no, you're the rando. Because I put the work in. I'm the king of anime, the king of manga. I know what I'm talking about. You're the same loser that sits here and hypes up whatever garbage shonen is like the flavor of the month. That's what you do. Oh, this shonen is getting a lot of hype. Now it's my favorite. I'm going to talk about it too. You get all of your opinions once again from other YouTubers, trash manga and anime YouTubers, uh, trash streamers, whatever the popular thing is online. That's where you get your opinions and your whole thoughts. You're like a Build-A-Bear. You see what I'm saying? It's like they take you. You have no stuffing, you know, at first. And then you start getting all the terrible opinions from from this uh this individual you start getting all of the bad taste from here and there and they start putting the pieces together and you're stuffed full of garbage but if i if i cut the bear and i pull out the stuffing you're still that same hollow loser that has nothing you have nothing without that and your stuffing isn't even stuff that's coming from you your stuffing is stuff that was put in you your followers sheep Frauds and everything in between. You have no free will. As a man, how can you allow other people to shape, other people that are not qualified to shape your way of thinking, to shape your mind? That's sad. See, people come to me, and you know why people come to me? is because they know that I'm talented. They know that I'm thought-provoking. They know that I have what it takes to elevate them. Not only to elevate myself, but elevate them to higher levels than previously established. I got people asking me on the daily, what should I read? What should I watch? Now, you might be saying, well, that's hypocritical because people are coming to you because I'm t intelligent, because I'm smart. They know I'm not going to lead them astray. There's a difference between listening to someone that knows what he's talking about and listening to someone that has no idea what the hell they're doing here in the first place they got lucky i was built for this everybody that has come to my channel and listened to me has left a better person fact so don't try to argue with me saying well that's hypocritical and you're contradicting listen you're a loser and i'm not that's all you need to know this is trash and anybody that watches it is a moron